Hello, how you doing? My name is Michael Gregory. I'm a, a, a resident of St. Louis my whole life, 40 years old. I um, hail from Ferguson, Missouri. I'm a descendant of Hughes, Hughes and Ellis and Simon Hughes and Ellis, slaves that are born on a plantation in North Carolina. Could you and, speak up a little yeah, bit? Yeah, I'm sorry. My name is Michael Gregory. I hail from Ferguson, Missouri. I'm 45 years old. I'm a descendant of Simon Ellis and Sylvia Houston Ellis, slaves that were born on a plantation in North Carolina that, that moved to Mississippi and eventually came to St. Louis in my second, uh, my current generation. So I was born and raised here. I have prepared a statement. I represent um, OFFER, which is Ohioans for Federal Reparations. I'm a board member of that organization, it's a 501c4. And can you speak closer to the microphone? Yes, I'm sorry. <laughs> Hold on one second, I had to prepare a statement. Cash payments must be prioritized in reparations for several crucial reasons. First and foremost, cash provides immediate and tangible relief to black Americans who have endured generations of systematic oppression and racial injustice. It acknowledges the economic impacts of slavery and systematic racism, allowing individuals to have agency in how they utilize funds to address their specific needs and aspirations. Secondly, cash payments serve as a symbolic recognition of the debt owed to black Americans. Monetary compensation is a direct acknowledgement of the unpaid labor exploitation and trauma inflicted upon enslaved individuals and their descendants. It signifies a commitment to rectify past wrongs and provide a sense of justice and restitution for the enduring socioeconomic disparities that persist, persist today. Furthermore, cash payments have the advantage of flexibility. They can be utilized according to individual needs and circumstances of recipients, whether it's to address educational expenses, improve living conditions, start a business, or invest in community development. Cash reparations grant agency and autonomy to black Americans to decide how best to utilize the funds for their own advancement. In conclusion, prioritizing cash payments is in reparations is a necessary step to rectify the historical and ongoing economic injustices faced by black Americans. It is not only acknowledgement that the immense harm caused by slavery and systematic racism, but also provides an opportunity to address the wealth gap, empower individuals, and foster great, greater economic equity. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, excuse me, I would ask, uh, uh, gentlemen, uh, can you provide that statement yeah. directly to the commission? Thank you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, how do you? I have a media outlet that I could give you. That uh, I have a Twitter account. How did you want me to give you that um, statement? Email. Uh, email to me. Okay. Thank okay. You. Great. Thank you.